Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we have a very special video. We'll be looking at some of our new species that we have acquired, all of which are rare or highly sought after. We also have an announcement to make regarding reaching the milestone of 300 subscribers, but more on that at the end of the video. Now, let's get into it, shall we? First up, we have a colony of Pseudo Neo Panera. This is a unique species living strictly underground. Ants that exhibit this behavior are known as cryptic. These ants form very small colonies, typically with around a max of 20 workers. So this 14 worker colony isn't particularly small by their standards. Another intriguing fact about them is their reproductive system. Unlike most ant species that have an egg laying queen, Pseudo Neo Panera relies on a fertile worker known as a gamagate. But perhaps the most fascinating aspects of these ants is their hunting strategy. Today, we observe them with a live cricket, as they only hunt live prey. Watch closely as they begin their hunt. The ants spray a sticky foam or acid that burns and immobilizes their prey. Once subdued, they move in with their powerful bite force to crush the insect. Shout out to Mamesia for these girls, link to his channel in the description. Next up, we have one of the most loved ant species in Australia, the Fidoli antipodum. This species is well known for their enormous queens that can reach up to 16mm in length, which is very large for a Fidoli. Despite their queen's massive size, the workers themselves are tiny, with minor workers only being around 2mm at the smallest, and on the flip side, the majors can be up to 6mm, which is the size of most other Australian Fidoli species. This species is found in most parts of Australia, although they are most commonly found in the southwestern regions. Despite their range, it is very rare to stumble across a queen. Because of how big the queens are, they are an easy meal for many predators like lizards and birds that wouldn't pass a slow moving free meal. I got this beautiful queen from a website called Ants and All. They're a great website with a wide range of ants from founding queens to small colonies. They've got it all. Go check them out. Link in the description below. This next queen is another weird yet wonderful one, the Amblypome australis, better known as the Dracula ant. Its name stems from its unique trait as a professional cannibal. This species almost exclusively feeds on the blood of its own larvae, a rather unsettling behaviour. However, these larvae possess an astonishing ability. They can heal themselves after being torn open and consumed, and they are completely fine to continue growing, just at a slower rate. It's a gruesome yet captivating process. For the ants to feed the larvae, to then in turn feed themselves, the ants hunt for other insects. These ants are subterranean, meaning they mostly live underground and occasionally go above ground. One reason they may come above ground is for nuptial flights, where virgin queens and male ants mate and then the queens go on to found new colonies. Finally, we have a rare bull ant, the Mimesia sp17. This species of the bull ant, despite being discovered years ago, still doesn't have a proper species name, and is simply dubbed as SP-17. Another fact about this species is that they are threatened, which means there aren't that many left in the wild. This colony is still young, only being about 10 workers strong. They are good hunters, bringing down crickets to feed to their fully carnivorous larvae. Unfortunately, we just moved them into a new setup and they are not yet comfortable enough to hunt. But, there is something that makes this colony very, very special. They have two queens. 
One queen lays the eggs and is the mother of this entire colony. But this queen's first worker didn't end up being a worker. Instead, it was a tiny queen elate that broke off its wings pretty quickly and is now just a worker with wing scars. As you guys probably know, we've just hit 300 subscribers. And because of this, we are planning on having a giveaway for a quality white on nest. But you may be wondering, how do I enter this giveaway? Just go down to the description box below and click on the Discord link. Once you have joined the Discord, just tell us that you would like to join the giveaway. Your name will then be added to a spin wheel which will be spun in two weeks time, so be quick. Thank you for watching this week's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, have a good one.